Oh no, you dropped your crucifix. Oh no! Watch the candles! Two. Okay. I don't know what. Why am I watching the candles? Those two. Now there's one. More <laughs> this. <laughs> I'm fucking done. So that was chapter one. Uh, I don't even know what that was called. <laughs> I genuinely have no clue what that was called. Chapter one. Da, da, da. Chapter two. Faith, chapter two. New game. Hello. Oh, I'm now... I'm no longer this priest. Uh, Father Garcia, you are hereby instructed to release Michael Davis from your custody and return him to his home immediately. Mr. and Mrs. Davis have already been contacted by our office. A representative of the church is currently en route to their home to discuss compensation in return for their discretion. You will meet our representative there and accompany him back to Rome. Cardinal Gifford. Can I... Oh, I, I also have a... Oh, I have a little wooden crucifix. I must be an old priest. <laughs> yeah, check my reflection in the mirror, Silent Hill style. <sighs> Could Mary be in this damn town? It's... Can I not sake the Bible? I feel like that would be useful. No. Oh. One day. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Is 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 my dude a serial killer? Uh, two weeks. I mean, in Venice, that looks like me after two weeks of work. Uh, three months. <laughs> is this the origin story of Creepy Gollum? <laughs> three months, my precious. <gasps> so I have him in the basement. Interesting. How are we doing today, my dude? I want to go home. I want to go home. Do you get better, my dude? Can I see mommy and daddy? I need to make you better first. Can I see me? Can I see you get on me? Can I see you? Can I see you? Can I see you? You know nothing, Padejo. You know nothing, Padejo. Jesus saves. Jesus saves. Oh, he's bleeding! Ah, oh, it is- oh no. Oh, oh, uh, 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 Jesus saves. <laughs> I'm just- I'm gonna- I'm just gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> You're fine. Oh! That's a lot of creepy symbols on the wall. Mmm, delightful. Oh, he's taken one of the photos. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> maybe maybe he likes that picture of himself. Maybe that's his new profile picture. <laughs> Hello. What's what are you what are you, are you stuck? What's oh no. Oh no, you're eating someone. Oh that's a oh that's an eye. Oh go away. Dios mio. What have you done? <laughs> Dios mio. <laughs> You can't hide from God. <laughs> you should trick that. I must go. My planet needs me. <laughs> it's 2 a.m. It is 2 a.m. Wait, what? Am I now John again? Have you forgotten already? The notes people leave behind seem to exist on the edge of memory. Pressing the escape key or the start button is a good way to remember what you don't realise you have forgotten. Notes. Father Garcia. Oh, okay, there's loads of notes missing. Cool. Resume. <laughs> am I, am I John again? 
<laughs> scared the shit out of me. <laughs> oh. That's a sad looking Christmas tree. Jesus saves. Well, now it's a holy Christmas tree. Um, notice, the current investigation being conducted at Gallup Cemetery by the State of Connecticut Historical Society has been postponed until further notice. In the interim, we ask the public to avoid the cemetery grounds, the surrounding woods, any wildlife, and any unidentified persons roaming the area. Thank you for your patience. Cool. And what does that fall under? Unidentified wildlife? Oh, God, the cemetery. Ba-ding! Cemetery, cemetery with automatic doors. Oh no! Yeah, I'm not sealed. It's fine. Clang, clong, clang. That top right one looks out of place. Jesus saves. Jesus saves. Jesus saves. Do you need Jesus? Oh no, but that one does. Any of these need Jesus? Nope. You need Jesus then. Uh, I shook hands with the devil. I looked him in the eye. He looked like a long lost friend. Be, oh, you you do not look good, friend. You. I'm not. I'm concerned that's going to come to life. Uh, dearest disciple, verily, not everyone who says Lucifer, Lucifer shall inherit his kingdom. You must first conjure his demon. You must first serve his demon. You must then walk among the children of men as his demon. Thus shall you receive the blessing of the unspeakable. Return to the Save family tomb whenever you are in need of rest. Gary. Disciple Gary. <laughs> Do either of these need Jesus? No. Save. Enter the spirit house. Ugh. This all feels a bit silent, Hilly. Hello. Ugh. Okay. Hello. I see. Hello. I see. Oh, I have a key. Good. Wait, is that the key from the house? Oh. What? <laughs> oh, now I have a white crucifix. Hello. Now you. You look upset. You also look upset. You also look upset. I don't know what I did. I don't know what I did. But oh, apparently I opened these two gates. What's what's this way? Lots of statues. Lots of really creepy looking statues. Certain one of these are gonna come to life. Did that change then? Did one of those statues just flicker? Right, so now let's go up. A crypt. A crypt I cannot... I cannot soothe <laughs> with my crucifix. Oh no. Oh no. Am I... Am I forever lost? I really want the run button. Oh no. Okay. So I can only go up and down on that bit. Alright, that's fine. I still look like a tentacle. Oh dear. Jesus saves, Jesus, Jesus saves. Go away. Go away, demon, demon, Gribbly. Where is it? Where? There it is. Come here. Lots of little hands blocking my path. What? Are you like a face hugger? Come here. Don't, don't run from the Lord. Oh, you're in the clouds, I see. Got it. There. There. I'm, I'm gonna guess I don't want it to touch me. Maybe I do. Who knows? Ugh. Oh, it's dropped a big jar of jam. That's unfortunate. Uh, any of these need, need healing? 
Uh, losing grandpa was the hardest thing I ever experienced. We were really close. I cried about it for weeks. Then my stepmom introduced me to some of her friends. They asked me, what you like to see your grandfather? Would you like to see your grandfather again? I missed him so much. I was willing to try anything. That night, my stepmom drove me to one of her friend's houses. They took me down to the basement. I saw my grandfather in there. Only it wasn't actually him. When I tried to run, they closed the basement door and locked me in. I can't remember much else from that night. My stepmom's friends are always coming by the house now. They tell me I have a debt to pay. They say they have work for me to do. There's always... Oh, there's that's a lot of missing heads. Many, many, many missing statue heads. Is there anything new and sexy in this bit? No? No. Can I replace the heads? <laughs> Hello, I am Statue John. Praise be Statue John. Go back in the save tomb. What does the save tomb do? Now? Oh, there appears to be only two people here now. That's not. Mm hmm. Okay, let's go this way. Uh, huh. Can I heal this tree? Oh, that's a that looks like a very heavy cross, my friend. Oh, this this one needs healing. There you go. It is with a great sadness that the Sterling community announced the passing of Cindy Marie Martin, 38, and Robert Kimball Martin, 40, devoted husband and wife and beloved parents. Their lives tragically came to an end on September 21st due to an accident in their home. Bob was a training advisor for the United States Navy, and Cindy was a CPA, and more recently, a stay-at-home mother. They were married March 12, 1969, nice, in, uh, Voluntown? Voluntown? Uh, though not particularly religious, they taught their children to be kind, generous, and involved in the community. A public closed casket memorial will be held at the Tilling Gast Funeral Tilling Gast Funeral Home at 10 a.m. Thursday. Burial service will proceed shortly after. Bob and Cindy are survived by their daughter Amy and twin boys Nate and Jason. Hi, I have a cross too. Your cross is bigger than my cross. You have a large cross, I have a small cross. But it's not the size, it's what you do with it. Do either of these need to be exercised? No. Does that? That needs to be exercised. Cool. What if I stand on that? Nothing. So now I have to go back past the statue with the giant cross that has now moved. Oh no, oh no, 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 bye. Oh, what is what are you? You're not, you don't seem too bothered by me, I'll admit. Mortis, indeed. Oh. Can I take the giant cross? Is this a thing I can do? Are these just spooky footprints, or are these actually a... Uh... No, they're just spookies. They're just spookies. Okay, so... It's spooky ghost time. Spooky ghost time. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. So now I come up here. Oh no! Ah, I'm stuck! Oh, piss! Mortis! Mortis.
I be there, Nope, nope, nope. Be gone, be gone, be gone. Now you're there, which means I'm gonna do that and then that. Ah, gotcha. Now where are you? Ah, gotcha. You gonna do a? Ooh, get away from me! Ah, gotcha. <laughs> ah, no, get away from me! My licorice. I think that's what it said. Any of this need uh, sanctifying? Nobody was thrilled when I got pregnant. Not even a little happy. Even the doctor seemed to be judging me. Each time I'd leave the doctor's office, I'd see this strange woman across the street. All she'd do is stare at me and smile. No words. Just a big, warm smile. Somehow, it made those visits a little more bearable. After I lost the baby, I saw her again across the street from the doctors. Her smile was as big as ever, but somehow not as warm and friendly as I remember. Yesterday, I was walking and was shocked to see the woman standing in the middle of the path. Now she was pregnant. She beckoned towards me. I followed her off the path into the woods. That's where I met Gary. Good. Excellent. Gary sounds fantastic. Can't wait to meet Gary. Now is there only one person? Yeah, there's only one person. But it has saved it. Ooh, was that a... That looked like a spider's web in the corner. I don't know if that was there earlier. Let's go north. Oh. Let's maybe not go north. It's locked. It's locked. Can I not just go around it? I can just go around it. <laughs> not sure. Not sure if that's supposed to be like that or not. But let's go into the woods. Into the mines. Oh. I see. So this is metaphorically locked. Got it. It's not actually locked. I can go around it, but it's supposed to be unlocked. So where's the third one, I wonder? Is it in here? Can I go this way? Nope. Can I go this way? Something weird about this space. A few moments later. Ah, there we go. I'll see you again. <laughs> I'll see you again. I've been freed. No more overbearing father turned violent alcoholic. No more hiding my bruises and cuts. No more pills and needles. No more getting laughed at and kicked around. They'll never laugh at me again. By day my body withers away, but by night my mind explores forbidden worlds of power and knowledge guided by beings of pure darkness. I have been trusted with secret knowledge of the demon seal. I have learned the correct conjuring sign, drawing the inverted star along the rocks arranged in five. First at the top left point and then down. I will lure them into the woods. Then I will show them my power. How exciting. Uh, was was there a star somewhere? I don't... Ooh, that's a mangled looking statue. Hi. Oh, I'm all alone. Oh, I'm... I'm there's a... There's a... Image. It's me. Me. I'm here. Hello. Hi. Oof. Oh, that's not what that unlocks, friend. Oh, I'm I'm bleeding. I am I am bleeding. I'm uh, that's not good. I might need to see a doctor. Are you a doctor? Are you a Jesus doctor? Oh, I'm leaving so much blood. So many bloods. 
It's unlocked now. Now with my blood. Oh no. It's the oh what's <laughs> what's going on? You look like a Nazgul. You look like the Witch King of Angmar. Is this do does any of this need Jesus? I apparently have healed as well, so I don't I'm not bleeding from the face anymore, which is nice. Um you don't need to be saved. Does any of this need to be saved? No. Oh no! It's it's demon end. Oh no. Demon end? Demon end? Tree beard? <laughs> I'm so suspicious of all these trees now. <sighs> Baby Gribbly again. Purple Amy. And a big white castle. She guards the door to underground purgatory. I have not seen her. Children fear her. I'm going to go in the house. Of course I'm going to go home. Confess thy sins. Oh no. Day one of our paranormal investigation into the old Snake Meadow Hill Church. We've got three cameras, a box of tapes and enough beer and beef jerky to last us a week. On, on our way in, we asked some of the locals about the church. It was mostly the stories we had heard before. Evil spirits dragging children into the con into the cornfield and secret tunnels under the chapel. But there was a spindly lady game that we hadn't heard yet. Apparently, it has something to do with summoning the spirit of a woman who used to take care of the orphans back in the 50s. There was even an old rhyme they told us. Walk the church from room to room and maybe you will see her. She will move when you do, but never try to trick her. Awesome. We're going to try and get, try the game tonight as soon as we get settled in. Fantastic. Can I... <laughs> I don't... I don't really want to be here. I want your cross though. <laughs> it looks like a better cross than mine. Crosses? Crosses? <laughs> Crosses? Skull in a box? Skull in a box. Night three. Shouldn't have come here. Tate's missing. Lars stuck behind basement door. Henry hasn't come back yet. Can't leave anyway. Great. Oh, oh good. A confessional. Excellent. I'm here to confess my sins. Oh, I'm here to confess my sins. Oh no. Oh, what have I done? Pray for me, Father, for I have sinned. What seeks have you yet to confess? I try to save a girl from evil, but my fears overcame me. I turned my back on the ministry and broke my vows to God. A year later, the girl reached out to me again, but in the end, I couldn't save her. I left her to die. I am sorry for me and my past sins. Thou hast said will. Here is my penance. Greet the child to me. Perform the sad of the attrition. And thou shalt have the peace thou seekest. Give thanks to the Lord for his good. For his mercy and yours forever. Oh, I didn't like any of that. Where am I now? Oh, I've literally, I've got, I've gone, I'm into another room. C cool. Haunted picture. Night one. We still haven't found a way into the basement, but we found something just as cool. A secret passage in the old confessional booth leading to this hallway. Henry's going into town to buy a crowbar. We'll see if we can get those boards off of some of those doors. But that's not even the best part. We caught an EVP. You can't hear it on the tape very well, but to us it kind of sounded like laughing. Thank God we bought a nice mic. We'll review it once. We'll review it on the sound gear once we get it back into town. A crying Mary. A crying Mary. 
I don't know what I'm supposed to do in here. So I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> this is really creepy. Hello? Hello? No. Oh no. Oh, I don't like that. What was that? That looked like a trap door. What's through here? Nothing. Nothing but doom. My flock, we are gathered here today to praise Tentacool and Jesus. Watch of the candles. Uh, okay. Can I take... Oh! Oh no, you dropped your crucifix. Oh no! Watch the candles! Two. Okay. those two. Now there's one. <laughs> I'm fucking done. Let's try this bit again, shall we? Oh, I couldn't get rid of you! Marcus. Bastard. So what? So if I just go between rooms, you just appear. <laughs> yup. <laughs> how do, how do you get, so don't revisit a room, is what I'm hearing. Do not revisit rooms. Do not revisit rooms. Got it. There's a very bendy looking candle there. Hello? Hello? Stained glass? Who wants a stained glass? Oh, it's a stained glass of what looks like an angel. And a stained glass of what looks like a saint. And a stained glass of a demon with an arm coming out of its mouth. And a stained glass of a crucifix. Bendy candle. Any of you interactable? No? No. No, you are not. How does how does that open? I want that to be opened. Watch the candles. One. Two. <laughs> I can't even move. I cannot move at all when that happens. That's unfortunate. Um, okay. Can I can I light the candles? I can't do anything with the candles. I don't think. Please, can I come in? Oh, 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 there's a, there's a wibble. What's through, what's, what's going on here? What's, what's distorting? Oh, oh. <laughs> so if the candles are lit, I can fight you. I get it now. But you are somewhere in these rooms. Somewhere. I just have to look out for the screen wobbles. Oh. Oh! It's the rooms! So you're in this room. Or you're not in this room. Now you're in the room to the left. Now you're not in this room. I wonder if that means that's where you are. That's where you are and I am. It probably doesn't, though. Which 
means we're both in this room. Excellent stuff. Ah! Mortis. Mortis. Just in case you didn't get that. Mortis. Okay. I understand that. So this is a... Can I do I have a map of this? No, I don't. So this is a representation of the rooms. I see. I see. Which means you're now in the room to my left. Uh, my right, even. And now you're still in that room. And now you're in this room. Gotcha. I'll get you a little bit. Da! Mortis. Mortis. That noise is somebody uh, renovating the house next door. So there's not an awful lot I can do about that. It is it is causing a, a bit of creepiness though, I won't lie. Okay, so you're in this room now, which is great. I just don't know where. Oh, you're here. Oh, are you here? Yes. Oh, get away from it. Oh, get away from it. Jesus compose you. Jesus compose. Yum. Daka, 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 daka. I use the power of organized religion. Yeah. Organized religion for the win. Darkness surrounds thee. 